Hey guys, welcome back. So, it's officially my eighth, ninth video on this platform. I'm a YouTuber, so, hi, how are ya? Um, so, this video, like always, there's no plan. We didn't reach 20 likes on my last video, so I'm not gonna eat the thing I'm scared of. But honestly, thank you guys for watching my video, cause I was able to reach 30 views in less than 24 hours. No, 40 views in less than 30, 24 hour, hours. So thank you guys, I appreciate it, I honestly do. Like every time I see that people are watching it more, I'm like, wow. I have fans, I'm kidding though. I'm like, oh my God, wow, that's so cool. And I have 30 subscribers, so thank you for the 30 people who actually had time or wasted their time and subscribed and pressed that little subscribe button. So, yeah, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Ew. I vlogged a little bit in school again. Again. I want to do like a full vlog. So my friends were saying I should do like, not a daily vlog. Not like a daily, daily vlog. But maybe I should do like a, what do teenagers wear nowadays? Or at least kids in my school. Because there's some interesting outfits, ideas. Yeah, so I might show that one day. I don't know when. I might show off to school. Not that it's cute or anything. It's like trash. Not trashy, because I go there. So it's run down. Yeah, run down. We can say that word, run down. So I have a stuffy nose, sometimes a runny nose. And I already can't speak English, so that just helps out my speaking skills. How's my m, &M? I hope my m, &M is showing. Hopefully, something I've never done. Never. And that is a mukbang. I'm kidding, no. I'm not doing a mukbang. I don't have enough money. I'm kidding. Um, no. I don't have food. I might order. I mean, cook. Cook some food later on. Oh, a friend of mine, he's starting YouTube. And he has an editor. And I'm like... Okay. So, no one offered to be my editor. Fakies. I'm kidding now. Um, I enjoy editing sometimes. It could be a. It could be time compute consuming, which I don't have that much time. So, okay. So um, let's talk about my U.S. history class. You go to my U to my school, and you're my U.S. history. I personally, he don't like to teach her, but low key though, she can be chill sometimes. But I always feel attacked. I get attacked by my teacher a lot because I always get moved or she always thinks I'm yelling or talking when in reality I'm not even talking. Like this one time I was legit talking to my friend Deborah or Yara Delis or Yara and I was legit just talking to the, I wasn't even with, no, I wasn't even talking at the time. I was legit just um, paying attention to a conversation between Debs and Yara and then I was like, Mm, okay, and then legit she said Andy stop talking. I was like I, was, I wasn't I was and then legit Like my other friends around that area. They even knew I wasn't even talking and then so they all just looked at her crazy And then she was like then she just kept what type type Kept typing in her like little computer like I was like fakey fruity whatever so I was like Ew, okay, whatever honest um u.s. History is boring like there isn't anything interesting like in world history i we at least learn about like different artists and the Ren not the renaissance the what's it called yeah the renaissance no not the renaissance the revolution or we learn about different artists different arts different all like italy and rome and spain i think I don't remember. And different artists and how people were trying to learn more illegally and how this guy would go into graveyards, steal bodies, and dissect them to notice things about the body, which helped out later in the future. So learned about different... We learned about the whole, like, a short little, like, Holocaust and the whole Soviet Union and the Russians and the Germans and all of that. And we learned about, what else did we learn about? We learned about the Civil War, not the Civil War, the 
World War One, World War Two, and all that jazz. And I was like, honestly lit because I don't know that teacher was very interesting. I feel and I got like I don't know the way that he taught. It was just like inter not interesting. It was like I don't know different. And with this teacher, she does teach as well. It's just I don't know. Sometimes I was like honors. This is honors. I'm kidding. Um, but yeah, U.S. history. I honestly don't. I care about. It's just I don't know. It's I know it's the history about our country and whatnot, and that's the country I live in. And legit, the only reason I like, the only time I felt interested was for our for our rights, which I was like, okay, nice to know I have this and this and this, and I can say, oh, it's my right to have blah, blah, and history. Is not honestly that much fun. Like I had a lot more fun back in ninth grade academy. Hopefully, I don't have to do U.S. history. You know, in gym, I saw in one of the bleacher thingies, I saw this textbook that said American history, which I'm like, we're already doing U.S. history. Why do we have to do American history? Is it just like, oh, just America? You know, we are just learning about America because the only time we ever talked about the different, um, the different countries like the european countries or the middle eastern or the asian uh countries was for the triangle trade slave trade and the race for the new world and that was legit it and i'm just like okay go off so school doesn't i won't i don't want to say it sucks because i legit like some of my classes i like photography literacy not so much gym. I like lunch. Lunch is technically a class, right? Right. But not U.S. history. And next semester, I finally go to do my math um, math segment of the year, which is legit. I have to do physics and mathematics. I'm just like, ugh, frick. I don't want to do any of those, like, at all. Because out of I'm not that good at thinking. Speaking, too. I barely even know how I got into the good classes for ELA and history. But yeah, so. Okay, so Yara's not right here. He Shirley's here. He fucked it up. We have Alejandra or Ali. We have Bianca. Bianca. Wave. Oh. And we have Deborah. Hi, Deborah. Um, of only about. 125,000 east of the Mississippi River, and no one ever. But yeah, so that's my opinion on the U.S. history. Honestly, I don't understand why we do. I mean, I understand why we do U.S. history. It's just, is it? I don't know. It's kind of boring. I honestly wish we did like something funner. U.S. history or like U.S. history, American history, not world history. I actually enjoy world history, but I would opt out of U.S. history and. American history and all of that, or Greek mythology, or Roman mythology. School sucks, period, period. I'm gonna become famous and <laughs> get out of school. Future plans. Yeah, this was the end of the video. Um, please like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I will, and all that jazz, and I will see you guys tomorrow with a new video, hopefully with a plan, or I might do the vlog tomorrow. Like a little, not a vlog, like, like little scenes around the day because I'm not going to pull out my whole camera and be like, hi guys, welcome back to my video. I'm like, ew, no. But yeah, so like, comment, subscribe. Uh, thank you to everyone who watches this, everyone who goes through this. And yeah, yeah, bye. I don't have a plan for this video. I'm sorry, guys. I'm supposed to be interesting, but I legit don't know what to even do. Today, I'm just going to ramble on, ramble Come on,